at some point I used to bike by here to go to work and at some point I had seen uh, all the cherry trees and I stopped in at some point to ask if I could pick some cherries and pay for the cherries and ran into somebody who was a member of the place here and I didn't know about it and uh, and they said yeah this is a great place and you come and you pay a yearly amount and you pick your own vegetables and it's fantastic and so that's how I discovered Tom was just because I was biking by it. I followed a two years course on organic agriculture very nice very interesting and at the end of this course we were with all the rest of my uh, classmates um, thinking like what are we gonna do now and, and then find out there's not really a possibility to start a farm because it's high investments high risks this kind of things until I got in contact with community support agriculture and that was for me really like an enormous boost of energy I got out of there just by seeing it on the plate it was really on the spot immediately like an electric shock Wow, this is it. My mother is quite conscious about ecological problem. We ate always organic, we even had an organic shop for a while. On the other side, and I feel two sides in me, it's my father who lived a business life, very economically uh, driven. And I think it comes perfectly together in, in community sport agriculture because it's both as important I think once you have the feeling in you how important it is, then, then there is no way around of acting towards your feelings or it would really be difficult for me to live with it, do something else than you know, what I feel is important. Mostly it's very simple, sustainability, it's being inspired by nature and keeping it simple I think is, is one of the best ways. If, if if you look to the house I'm rebuilding now, you could go into high-tech ecology, but I, I think sheep wool as insulation is, for example, a very good one. And uh, yeah, avoiding certain types of, of glue or paint, and just going back into paints that are based on uh, plant oil. Still every day I learn things about ecology which I didn't know and it's hard to say what is most difficult because it's not that difficult. I mean for me it would, one of the most difficult things is having a car. I had a car and it makes me completely unhappy so not having a car is, is more easy. It would be nice if, if I could leave this planet more clean as I came on it. That would be one of the goals.